it's Bonnie. Happy Saturday. My mom came in to say hi. Hi. <laughs> Thank you all for all the well Thank wishes. You. She's doing much better, but she doesn't feel like doing a video today, which I don't blame no her. <laughs> no makeup. <laughs> so I'm actually going to do my top seven favorite body lotions for the sale today. Bye. <laughs> and she's going to go back and watch TV. <laughs> But she wanted to come on and say hello to everybody. So And thank you. And thank you. My mom on to show everyone. Yes, she's okay. She's doing well. She's in the living room watching a movie. But oh my gosh, what an ordeal this week. If you've had a parent in the hospital during this pandemic, it is not easy. Oh my gosh. There's just so much has changed. The visiting has changed. The staffing is slow. That was definitely our deal. So I'm very glad to have her home. So Bath and Body Works. I didn't go to Bath and Body Works today. I'm like, I'm not driving all the way up there. We had we had too much going on this weekend. I'm like, there's no way I'm going into Bath and Body Works today. But the sale is going on for $4.95 on the moisturizers. If you use your 20% off coupon, if they let you, I've heard they are, it brings it down to like three something. I'm like, holy moly, that's the, like the best deal ever. So it does include the creams, the lotions, and the body butter. The only body butter left online is Japanese cherry blossom and gingham. I did get the gingham today. I did get a small haul. I also got Sunset Glow in the body cream, which I needed. I got a few other ones and some of the men's ones that I don't have. So I'll be reviewing those. So today I wanted to do, I haven't done a top list of my favorite body lotions. I've done the shower gel, the mist, and the cream, but I haven't done the body lotion. So today we're talking about body lotion. So I'm gonna go from number seven to number one. I got my top seven favorites. So the body lotion is a little bit different. This has shea butter, coconut oil, and vitamin E, whereas the cream has shea butter, cocoa butter, and aloe. The cream is definitely thicker. I'm gonna show you the difference. So this is the cream. Check it out when you put it on your hand. Oops. I just dropped it. <laughs> Pick that one up. There we go. See how thick the cream is? Whereas the lotion is a lot thinner. So when you, it's almost, it's not watery, but it's definitely thin where the cream is is definitely a thick product. So that is the difference. And it's funny because, you know me, I always polish my furniture with the body cream. I found I can't polish my furniture with the lotion. I think it is because the cocoa butter and the shea butter mixed together make that thicker a formula and that's what it makes it so good to polish your furniture with. I also, I also use the body butter to polish my furniture, but never the lotion. <laughs> I do love the lotion though. Um, I tend to use the lotion a lot during the day. I find it, um, I use it like as a hand cream. Um, I like that thin formula. And the lotion is a 24 hour uh, nourishing moisture, lightweight formula absorbs into skin, whereas the cream says, um, rep, uh, where is this? It's uh, clinically tested for 24 hours of moisture. Um, it basically says the same thing. So I don't know. Never tested the 24 hours. Don't know if that's like, <laughs> but anyway, I do like the lotions. They tend to last longer too. For some reason, um, shelf life on the lotions is a lot longer than the cream. So I do tend to stock up on lotions when I have um, a sale. So today's definitely a good day to stock up. So number seven on my list is the sugared cherry crisp. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good in the lotion. So it's funny, a lot of people don't like the sugar cherry crisps. They're like, it's a little like uh, cough syrupy. I don't think you get as much of that in the lotion. Anytime you smell the lotion, I always usually say this in my videos, you definitely get a little bit of a different scent um, than you do in the cream or the shower gel or the mist. Because the lotion smell itself a lot of times like comes through with the scent which is fine because I love the smell of body lotion. I don't know why, it's just a really relaxing scent to me. And then when you layer in the scent, it smells really good. So sugared cherry crisp is definitely, I you know, this is a big yay for me. That's number seven. Champagne, apple, and honey. Oh my gosh, you guys, it is so strong in the lotion. I highly recommend this one. This is, if you like that, like, um, 
champagne apple, very sparkly. I would definitely pick up a champagne apple and honey. Um, this is a really good one. This is a year-round scent too. I mean, I would I, you could use this in the spring easily. Um, number five for me. Remember, I said sparkling plum prosecco is a Christmas scent. Okay, we're moving into Christmas. Oh my gosh, it smells so good in the lotion to me. Um, this one is the juicy plum, uh, ju juicy purple plums. Wild blackberry and sparkling citrus. I love this in the lotion, you guys. Um, this is definitely tops for me in this formula. And I like the purple cap. <laughs> Number four is sweater weather. We're definitely moving into sweater weather time here. Oh my gosh, I could smell these all day. You know what? You want to talk about good mental health. All these scents really put you in a good mood. Sun crisp apple, autumn leaves, orchard woods. I used a lot of body lotion this week. <laughs> it's funny because when my mom was in the hospital, it was just kind of stressful having her there and everything. And I'm like, you know what? Aromatherapy is your best friend. <laughs> Vanilla Mocha Cafe. It's funny because I don't love the Vanilla Mocha Cafe in the shower gel or the cream. My mother loves it in the shower gel. Me, not so much. I like it in the cream, though. For some reason, I think the cream tones down that really sharp, like, coffee scent that just kind of overwhelms you. I don't know. I just really like it in the lotion. I, I just discovered this, and I like the gray cap. <laughs> So that was pretty awesome. Number two, Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. I don't have the new ones included in this list, like the White Pumpkin and Chai. I don't have them in the body lotion yet, and they're not included in the sale today. Oh my gosh, this smells so much like fall. You know, like, this is like the absolute quintessential fall scent, but you know what my favorite is this week that I've been relying on? Strawberry Pound Cake. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's, I, you know, it's funny. I am surprised that there's people out there that don't like strawberry pound cake. Literally, this is my favorite Bath & Body Works scent of all time. I will always go back to strawberry pound cake. The minute I smelled this one, I was like, best smell ever. And it's exceptionally wonderful in the lotion. I can't stop smelling this. I'm going to put some on. <laughs> so, squeeze it out. Like I said, I like this on my hands and especially my arms. I usually apply a lot of this like every day, like every like two or three hours I'll put, I'll put body lotion on sometimes. And I feel like it just moisturizes my skin. I can smell it on my skin. Kind of nice aromatherapy going on there. So anyway, strawberry pound cake is number one. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all of the well wishes. My mother will be back doing a video once she's feeling a little bit better. <laughs> I'm sure she'll, I'm sure she'll, once the Christmas stuff comes out, she's going to want to do a Christmas video. So I'll have another video today. I have a, I have a Vlogtober Vlogoween video coming up. Check out my new t-shirt. I got a Kohl's. I love the Kohl's holiday t-shirts. I'm addicted. <laughs> so anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.